native speakers in English. In English, we don't cut words, we link them together. Have a look at the first example. A beginner, the native speaker in English, would pronounce this, I like it. I like it. But in English, in speech, in connected speech, we link words together. We put them together like this. I like it. I like it. The first word here ends with a consonant, which is ka. And it is linked to the second word that begins with a vowel sound, A. I like it. I like it. Repeat after me. I like it. I like it. I like it. I like it. Very good. Second example. Have a nice day. Have a nice day. In English, we don't cut words and they told you. We pronounce it. Have a nice day. Have a nice day. Repeat after me. Have a nice day. Have a nice day. Have a nice day. Have a nice day. So, the last sound in the word have. What is it? The last sound. The. And what about e? Silent. Silent. Before them. Okay? Let's try to pronounce uh, 
these uh, noun phrases and link them together. First one, an enormous animal. An enormous animal. An enormous animal. An enormous animal. The next, an overweight uncle. An overweight uncle. An intelligent elephant. An intelligent elephant. See how the sounds are linked. We link this with this. And this with this. The last consonant sound becomes part of the next word. Like this. An intelligent elephant. Elephant will sound like telephant. Did you notice that? Telephant, like telephant. As if you say telephant. An intelligent telephant. Repeat it for me. An intelligent, hold on. An intelligent telephant. 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 An intelligent elephant. An intelligent elephant. Hold your breath as you speak. Don't stop and take your breath. An intelligent elephant. An intelligent elephant. An intelligent elephant. An intelligent elephant. This is called a um, consonant vowel link. Consonant vowel link, in which you link a consonant sound to a vowel sound. 